Hey friends, it's Hope and today I'm here to do my best in books video for June 2016. This video is going to be very short because I'm only going to do three categories for this month's video. I also didn't want to do a really long video because I knew I needed to film today, but today at work I actually needed to work in our warehouse because a lot of the guys that usually take care of my volunteers are on vacation. So I've been in a warehouse all day pretty much pushing and pulling pallets and picking up product for the last eight hours and so I'm still really sweaty and I smell really bad and it's also crazy storming outside and I'm a little worried that our power is going to go out soon and if you hear a whole bunch of thunder that is why. But yeah without further ado let's just go ahead and get started. The first topic that I always talk about are my favorite female and male characters and for me this was super easy. The thunder's crazy. The best female character that I read this month was Shazi from The Rose and the Dagger by Renee Audier. I really loved Shazi in the first book and I just loved her even more in the second book. She was just so determined to get the job done and she didn't give up on love even though she was faced with some major adversity. She was a strong character with a ton of personality and a lot of passion and I really loved that about her in this book. For the best male character this month I had to give it to Nikolai or Nick from Amor Amor by the Richie sisters. Friends, I absolutely adored him so very much. I was having a really hard time trying to figure out if I liked him better than Dimitri from the Vampire Academy series and the reason why I was comparing the two was because they are both Russian and while Nick doesn't have like that thick Russian accent like Dimitri does, he was giving Dimitri a run for his money. In this book, we see Nick as the leader of his family. He is there to provide for his siblings. He's very protective and a little bit hard on himself, sets very high expectations, but when he knows that he loves something or he really cares about something, he gives it his all. He never gives up. He is super passionate and very encouraging and is just very hardworking and I really admire that about this character. And I'm I mean, he was just a completely swoon worthy character as well. The next topic I want to talk to you guys about is the best new to me author. I think I read like four new to me authors this month and for me the best new to me author was Penny Reed who wrote a new adult book called Truth or Beard and it is the first book and I believe a companion trilogy or maybe it's going to be a companion series called The Winston Brothers and friends it was so funny. I absolutely adore this cover. It just really embodies how the book felt. And Penny did a wonderful job just bringing out the personalities and each and every single character in this book. I thought that the writing was effortless. It wasn't something that confused me. It was fast paced. It made me laugh. It made me tear up. And I cannot wait to continue to read this series. And for the last topic I want to talk to you guys about, of course, it's going to be the best book that I read this month and this was so easy for me because this was the book that put me out of my five star reading slump. I haven't read a five star book in so many months but friends a more and more just took that out and the moment I read the very last page I knew I was going to give this book a five star rating. I was just completely captivated by this book. The setting was so unique. I really adored the characters as well but just the last few pages I was still so gripped and so in awe and I'm so glad that I finally picked this book up. It was everything that I needed and if you guys are a fan of new adult books, I highly recommend this one. Thank you friends so much for watching today. I hope you guys have a wonderful day and I'm sure I will see you soon. Bye!